Ladies and gentlemen, this is Fighter Get Knocked Out. I just seen top rank Shakur Stevenson. He claiming that he ready to prove the doubters wrong. Forget about him, Billy. There will always be doubters. And that the fight with him and De La Santos, his hand was hurt. It was a fluke. He ain't lying. So we going to react and dig into this little video he got going. So let me stop talking. Let's get it in. T -t -t Today, Junior. Hey, y'all hear that top rank that? I like that. That I'm going to have to work on that. God damn it. And now the WBC lightweight champion. Out of Houston, Texas right there. He down now with mob ties. God damn it. What's the meaning, the definition of mob ties? Movement of bosses together in elevated structure. Mm. Yeah, ain't that, yeah. Yeah, ain't that powerful? I never, I never knew. No, I never heard it yeah. that way. Basically, our goal is say that one more time. Movement of bosses mm -hmm. together in, in elevated structure. Mm. Oh, okay. Yeah, so, all this here. All this here. <laughs> so we gotta be in the heart of Texas, goddamn. Out here in Texas, goddamn, they got Beyonce traded truth, and we can't forget Stevenson. If Big X the plug had to remix it. Big shout out to them boys, and I can't forget back to Texas. Let's dig back to the video. In of the world, Chuck. Bump it on his chest. But at the end of the day, he gonna get his hand raised. At the end of the day, he gonna get his hand raised. Who does Shakur Stevenson want next? Let me take a step back and assess myself. Um, I can't give you no names right now. I felt bad this performance. And he told y'all what it was. I can't take no names right now. I feel bad after that performance. Because after all the craziness I was talking, and then I underperformed. I was expecting more of you. You're unskilled, untrained, and unworthy. So now it's time for me to shut my mouth, get back to work in the training camp, and on my next fight, when y'all see me, it's going to be nothing but spectacularness. And I just made that word up. Hey, Shakur, we made it up for you. And the next time y'all see me in that square church circle, the chamber of truth, I'm going to be on spectacularness. Yeah, there you talking about. And now it's time to learn linguistics, how language itself works. Over the next 16 episodes, we'll look at the structure of language, from the smallest building blocks of sounds and hand shapes to the structure of words and meanings. Back to the um, video. Uh, I got to go back to the drawing board and work on a lot of things and uh, come back. You better wake up. The world you live in is just a sugar-coated topping. There is another world beneath it the real world and if you want to survive it you better learn to pull the trigger several times i put out great performances and then you have one bad night that's the cold game with today's boxing reality you can be out there say if it was floyd 49 times spectacular and you take an l on your 50 they don't give a damn bro it's no hoes barred out here in this goddamn what they call it on Ready Player One in the Oasis. James Halliday saw the future, and then he built it. He gave us a place to go, a place called the Oasis. This is a cold game, goddammit. You gonna sink or you gonna swim? You either bound to drizzle or you gonna pick your punk ass up? Ding! That is his name! If he can hang, he's got to get out the game! And then everybody act like you're not that guy. And, and, they forgot about. And that's another thing. In this business, y'all getting ramshackled in the chrome dome. You can't be worried about what nothing outside of your chrome dome and your immediate team think. Otherwise, that's your ass. It's your ass, Mr. Postman. And that's one thing with Shakur. That's his problem. He give a damn what other people think. Nah, you got to let them hands fly and knock motherfuckers out and give a damn what they say. And he partially do that because he's saying if something happened, goddamn, I'm going to stay on the outside and box him. So he know that it's just on the different side of the polarities and he need to figure out that and uh, make it switch in his own goddamn head. Back to the video. Oh, the Jamel Hammer before me. Ah, 
on top of the turnbuckle, goddammit. Went out there and put hands on him. See, he felt strong right there. He felt confident against that fighter, against Jamel Herring. That's how he need to feel every fight. I don't know what it was right there, but that night, that's when his offense was looking um, great and his defense was looking great. He had two working with him together, goddammit, in unison. That's the Shakur Stevenson that we can be like, that might give Tank a little trouble. That's the goddamn Shakur we want to see. The one versus Jamel Herring, goddammit. And they do show that one as the highlight, goddammit. There you go. Get your shit together. They forgot about me versus Oscar. Drop that man up. In control. And then dropped him. With the right hand. I forgot he put hands on Valdez, goddammit. Talking about it was the green tea. It was the green tea. Valdez. Hey, it's the green tea Valdez. Y'all remember that shit? Look at him strapped up with TB. And you know Terrence got a fight coming up August 3rd. And I'm going to be right there to call the blow by blow. What the hell y'all talking about? And I'm going to be here to do the live blow by blow with Shakur Stevenson. And that's what I do. I focus on the blow by blow, get them shorts off. And then I'm working on the channel, goddammit. Because a certain coach um, got me right, goddammit, along with myself and the wife. Um, back to the video. They forgot about Yoshino. Hey, Yoshino. Hey, talk about the one. Hey, um, and how many people has you slain? Y'all seen goddamn what's that shit? Tales from the um, Tales from the Hood. And how with Special K? And how many people have you slain? Hold on, let me rewind this shit, Nitty, just a little bit. Goddamn it, talk about Shakur, baby. Hey, hey, they forget about Yoshino. Um, talk about the people. Goddamn it, talk about the victims. That's the thing. Hashtag talk about the victim. They forgot about Yoshino. And another knockdown score. Sitting him down like a child. You put a counter-punching southpaw that can also punch in front of me and only got one hand. I think the greatness was the fact that I made it work that night. He made it work that night on the fly. He was fighting with one hand. We remember Tank messed up his hand and he was fighting and had to implement his boxing with Aesop Pitbull Cruz. Hey, look, this shit got them. The parallels are starting to line up. And you see me wiggling the index in the pinky. Hey, the parallels starting to line up, goddammit. Hold on, look at them. Focus, look at them, goddammit. I need me a Shakur Stevenson hairline. That's just the short, shite, right box, goddammit. Because he's in the box at the end of the day. That boxing ring. Talk to him, goddamn Shakur. When I retire or when the end of my career comes. Look at them working on them comics. Working them combinations and then looking at them like, yeah, my work is great. My work will be written in stone. Only time will tell. Back to the article. That's I mean, gonna be a fight. The video, goddamn it, just the video. I'm tripping. And people gonna look back on it and they gonna understand, like, okay, he was one of the greatest. Cause we've been through some. Oh, God. But they know. 